Hi, everyone. I'm meteorologist Susie Martin with your national coast-to-coast -coast weather forecast. I thought we'd stay, take a little bit of a step out of the U.S. and look at what's happening in the Caribbean as La Sufria volcano in St. Vincent has erupted. And this is a volcano that's been dormant since 1979. This has been making huge headlines across the world as this island has been coated in ash. Power outages and evacuations have been underway. A very tragic sight for the St. Vincent Island, as long with neighboring islands that have been feeling the impact from the ash. You can see the explosions here on satellite, an incredible sight to see, and our hearts go out to them, of course. So no volcanoes happening here in the U.S., but we do have our fair share of uh, active weather. Now we've got to warmth building out ahead of a disturbance that's been really resulting in uh, some cooler temperatures actually across the Great Lakes region. A cold front associated with this large occluded low is going to be triggering rounds of stronger thunderstorms, especially pegging areas like Florida with the risk for severe weather. But you can see this counterclockwise spin of the low. And this will continue to generate showers and again stormy weather to the south. And then we've got this shot of colder air and moisture building behind this, which will result in snow threats for parts of areas like North Dakota, the northern plains. So winter's not over quite yet. Here's a look at the snow forecast. Still plenty of uncertainty with the exact amount. So we'll continue to watch for that. Here's a look at tomorrow's outlook. We'll, of course, keep you up to date right here. Thanks for watching.